With introductions out of the way, a countdown is on screen. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, drone. Here we go. It's the final. And it's a good start very already. Very interesting to see. We've got we've got Team VS going, taking the Joker lane first. So everyone else has gone straight over the flyover. So we'll see how they end up as they come around the corner there. We're going to see them quite tight together, aren't we, Chad, here now with these finals? Oh, yeah, this is looking very interesting. I think we're going to be very, very close. It'll be when the pit stops start happening that they're going to start splitting up. Let's catch and the colours, you see what yep. we've got. All right, well, on the red colour is Dubai Drone Tech. And on the green is VS Mishiryakov. On the blue is Dutch Drone Race Team SQG. And finally, on the white drone is Tornado X Blades Bernie UK. And Chad, who've we got in the lead right now? Looks like we've got uh, Team SQG, if I uh, read my colors correctly. And they're doing quite well. Oh, it's getting very, very close. We go. We've got uh, Red, so Drone Tech, who had a bit of trouble with that flyover gate there. That's catching out a lot of people. That's what caught me out as well. And the rest of the track flows quite nicely, but yeah, you've got to be very careful there. What do we have in front? It looks like Alan, oh, it's in fact uh, Benny UK out in front. He's pushing quite hard. I think he knows he has to push quite hard because I believe he's still on the two pit stop strategy. So he's going to be fast, but he's going to have to stop twice. Yeah, so he's using all that speed, which means he's using a lot more power. Exactly, oh, yeah. Oh, what a great... And he's taking that flyover so well. He's practiced that extremely well. And we've got the SQG. They had a little bit of a problem there. They're all actually taking that fly over quite well. But Benny UK is uh, way out in the lead there and doing his thing. He knows he has to push hard, but he's just, you can tell, he's so comfortable with that. He's, he's got it all lined up perfectly. All right, Chad, we must point out, ladies and gentlemen, now we are calling this huge climb up right here the Terror Tower. I mean, it witnessed a lot of unfortunate events. And right here at the peak of the championship, we are witnessing an interesting display of endurance and strategy as they are going super fast with zero collusion course. It is quite amazing. Chad, what is your say on this since you has have met up with this unbelievable terror tower uh, we have a bit of a disagreement together but we'll, we'll live it out uh, she's an interesting one and, and she's caught many people including me but uh, she's she's an interesting lady i see that i see you have issues with safe entries and with going full speed i see uh, yes <laughs> so All as right. we come we've got bandy uk coming past again and He's, he's flying that tower well. Yes, he's, a, he's at least uh, a third of a lap in front of the other guys. The other guys, though, it depends on their pit stop strategy. I think we're probably going to be looking probably at the next lap, and he's going to be after coming in for a pit stop. So we'll see how he ends up compared to the other guys there. Generally speaking, if you've got a, a two pit stop strategy, you're going Whoa. to be uh, pitting at around about lap four. So we'll see who's got the two pit stop strategy and who's got the one pit stop strategy. He's pulling well away, Yusuf. He's pulling well away in front. Yes, indeed he is. Right now, I just witnessed a and great moment of recovery. A pit stop right here, as we can see it, ladies and gentlemen. For and team number four, Tornado X Blades, Benny UK. Are having a battery change, and that's their pit stop. Now to see who's going to be pit stopping as well. Who's on the pit, uh, two pit stop strategy. So whilst Luke, his team, is working feverishly to change the battery there, and they've actually been doing some pretty quick changes Okay, well, so we've got the blue team, which is SQG. They're still going, so they might be on a, a one pit stop strategy. Very interesting. No one else has pitted. All right, I'm going once again. That it was a safe free entry to that climb up. Very wonderful. And ladies and gentlemen, you are watching the live uh, drone cam feed from Dubai Drone Tech. The entire fan players are going for Dubai Drone Tech. I could say the have surely achieved a lot of fans. They've come a long way, had a rough start, but they are keeping up consecutively. Very consistent, just as I thought. They're, everyone's flying extremely well and extremely consistent, which is good to see. They're pushing one another. This is some uh, really cool racing. Oh, we've got someone down, which is blue, which is Team SQG. I'm not sure whether or not they can actually get back up from there, so they might be officially out of the race. Have you seen what happened just yet? There was a pit stop incoming right now yes. for that drone. However, it ended up bad. This will be interesting. I'm not sure whether they're allowed to pit or not, or whether or not he's technically crashed. 
the, the, the pilots being held there where the other team's giving them some tips and information on to get back in this race. Ongoing, we've, we've got, got Rand taking their joker lane, I believe. Yep, Team Drone Tech is taking the joker lane. Our team VS is going over the flyover. I, th I would say everyone's done their uh, their joker lanes by now, but I'm not 100% sure. This, this is where it gets very interesting because the pit stop strategy has spread, er spread everyone out, so we don't actually know who's coming first and yeah, who's coming it's second. Right. It's very hard to, to uh, keep track. We have White closing in, a very safe entry to buy Drone Tech in the Red Drone, making their turns as planned and very, very consistent. Ladies and gentlemen, more information about the track. There is something called the Joker Lane and the Shortcut Lane. Both kind of resemble, res there is a resemblance to one another, and each team, they are allowed to use this only once as a, a strategy to ensure that they win in this final race. And this is the final race indeed of this championship. Back to you. It's been a great couple of days. It's all come down to this. But here we go now, Van UK with a great, he's flying that. He's really got that, that flyover sort of. He, he's, yeah, he's got he's it now, so super smooth. It's very rare that I've actually seen him have to uh, turn around and take it again. And that really is the lesson you've got to learn there. It's what caught me out. I wasn't quite uh, lined up for it and I tried to take it and I hit it. So. Uh, anytime you see something having to take it a couple of times, you know that they're having trouble with it. And Luke's been solid as a rock all, to, all night. Safe entry for Dubai Drone Tech and Green follows also well. Nice move. Well pilot. Yeah, well flown. I must say these are some pretty impressive laps they're putting in there. But lap after lap, they're actually getting some solid laps in, which is good to see. So they're obviously very comfortable. They've done a lot of laps. Is Luke, that the second? Yes, yeah, this is so? Benny UK's second, second pit stop. Pit stop. As we're coming around, so we've got Drone Tech still flying as well, and Team VS as well. So we're down to we're down to three now. And this looks like a very quick stop for uh, Benny. Oh, They've got to be pretty happy with that, ready to go, and off he goes, ready to take off. There he goes. Just as my drone team team drone tech. right behind this, him. This might be for the battle for the lead right now between That's these guys. I think they've all evened up. So don't quote me, but I think we've got our. Everyone's on the same lap, so this is where it gets very interesting. You know, Chet, I do believe that whatever team goes up really fast in acceleration towards that climb up, that's a very big gamble and a stunt. It yeah. cost them the whole match. It's 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 all to do with the timing, but look at him go. Oh, look he's at flying that. strong Benny now. Is, look at him go. Benny is already UK is already out in front. He has just put in an amazing lap. He came out of the pits there and he was probably about a quarter of a lap oh. behind and he's now in front. That is amazing. So then we've got Drone Tech and then we've got Team VS coming in now for the third there. What pressure but on this, what an expensive this stage, race. Yes, it yeah, is really tense and it's getting fired up and the crowd as well is getting fired up with the competitors as well. You'll never know how this is going to end up and there's going to be only one number one for this championship. And it's worth note, any one of these guys, all of these guys have worked extremely hard, so uh, they deserve the win, but it's looking like Banning UK is out in front here. He's just, he's amazing, what can I say? I think everyone's been impressed with uh, with young Luke's flying the whole time here, time tie here. Everyone knows this oh. guy's name. Ooh, Ooh, very, oh, very, very close. Flying yeah. for a quarter of a million dollars, right here, right now. Incredible. This is amazing. Yes. There is such a short distance between the two drones, and we're talking green and red. And red is to buy drone tech and the VS Mishiriakov from Russia. Two very small distance between them, but they are going wild. Oh! And team that VS was is the down. green drone. Green drone VS Mishiriakov is yes. down. So it's now between. Uh, now between Drone Tech and uh, Benny UK. At, at this stage, it looks like Benny UK They recovered. Oh, no. Whoa. Team Drone Tech. They are they back and they are kicking. First. Yes. Wow. That's incredible. Great recovery by VS Mishiriakov, ladies and gentlemen. And that is part of the rules. If your drone collapses, you have to recover it in pilot mode. Any manual recovery will result in disqualification. Well, it very much looks like we were wrong that the uh, Team Benny UK wasn't on the lead lap. Right, that looks like another pit stop. 
I think there's a couple of happy people over there. That's yeah. that is pretty cool. There's a bit of cheering it, happening over there. It's time it's for celebrations. Still too early to judge, ladies and gentlemen. It is still all about the best lap, and the best lap will be decided through the judges by viewing all of the durations of every lap taken, and then we'll be crowning a winner at the end of this championship. Wow! I can hardly breathe. My heart's pumping away, Chad. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. You know, the question is, how fast was the fast? lap wow. now I've heard a couple of 35 second lap times being uh, thrown around by a couple of pilots and that's pretty fast so I'll be very interested to see how fast the laps actually got that is the two hundred and fifty thousand dollar question <laughs> indeed yes, it is it is maybe it might be me but I doubt it so real your in your initial 